Hi guys, welcome to another video from Overbyte Gaming, and today we're doing doing a bit of a concurrent gameplay thing. Because uh, Inzoi, they dropped the character creator finally on Steam, so let's take a look at it. If you don't know what Inzoi is, it's uh, I've only been aware of it for like less than a year myself. And what it is, it's potentially a Sims um, competitor, or perhaps Slayer. Uh, so it looks very good. It's running the Unreal Engine, so even though I've had to link it to my Steam account and my Crafton account, Crafton, if you're not familiar, the only thing I've played from them is uh, Callisto Protocol. And I quite like that. I know a lot of people didn't, but I did, so... Uh, um, all I've done so far is go to graphics options. My first time trying it. It's just a character creation suite. So, uh, uh, I've bumped the preset up to cinematic. I've taken off motion blur because that's for the birds. I've taken hardware ray tracing off uh, because, yeah, I'd, I'd rather have a bit of frame rate. I've increased max for FPS to 60. Uh, it came with DLSS on quality anyway, so I just left it at that. That's all I've done. I've not pressed this button yet. I've just spent 10 minutes linking my my Steam account to a crafting account, which I reckon I've already got one because of Callisto Protocol, but I couldn't get it to log in, so I have a new one now. Yay. So let's see what we got. Choose a name. Okay. Let me be in secretive of my last name there. Ha <laughs> ha! You're not fighting me, fools! Here we are. See, ah. I have so much trouble seeing the cursor. It might just be where I'm fucking old, you know? Right, so let's create a Zoe. Okay, this is uh, Crafting R Korean uh, studio, so I don't know if. Yeah, we'll have an adult. We'll be. I suppose I should remake a man, but like I'm less interested. I'd rather see what I can get up to with the ladies. <laughs> and I know, I know. Oh dear. Uh, but uh, they have confirmed mods are a thing, so I'm sure once it comes out, I will make it as absolutely stealthy as my Sims 4 currently is. So let's see. Traits. We have traits. Select categories. Uh, da, 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 da. Well, what should we be? Safety conscious. It's boring one ever. Ugh. A charmer, perhaps. What do we think? Kind and generous charmer. Keywords, kind, big heart, sociable, possessive, lighthearted, ambitious. How does possessive and lighthearted go to... I don't know. Oh, I haven't got metrics on. There we go, boys. You can see what we're doing. Uh, values, challenger, accomplishment, authority, and love. Okay. Let's just be fixated on relationships. Frequently feels a flutter. Or oh. builds a romantic relate. There we go. That's the one. <laughs> okay, so we've got some presets. Let's have, a, let's have a look at those. Uh, okay. Apply. All right. These are all very sort of Gen Z esque. Oh no, we're getting, we're getting, to be fair, we're getting some, uh, some. Ugh, ugh. Okay, uh, there's stuff I could work with there. Quite a lot of variety in what I'm seeing, so that's good. I was kind of expecting to be sort of skewed towards Asian just because it's a Korean studio, but uh, I mean, there are certainly a lot of Asian examples here, but uh, okay, let's see what we can do ourselves then. So, um, there we go, we can have a look around. Right, you know the first thing I'm going to do is see how far, how, how much of the outfit I can actually remove. If, if it's if it's too much I may have to cut that part but we'll, we'll try it so let's see outfit 
Uh, right. Uh, 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 oh, yep, there it goes. There it goes. Oh, those are the earrings. Okay. Right, big reveal. No, very, very... Uh, what's the term I'm looking for? Conservative. Something I normally quite like. Never mind. Oh, see, now I can't find the fucking cursor again. They need to, like, do better with that. It's such a light screen. I mean, I'm ter I always lose the cursor in games anyway, so I'm like... All right, body. Can we at least give her some big tits? Oh, maybe. Uh, oh, that, that seems to have just spread them. Spread them, love. <laughs> um, there we go. Lee approved. Oh, yes. Oh, dear. No, 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 no. no, no, no. Okay, so you... That's actually quite impressive because it does like does the jowls around here. That's quite cool. But yeah, it's it's a bit bit much. Uh, well, uh, oh god. Um, there we go. Problem solved. I've st I've got to do the tits again, but whatever. Let's see how hench we can get. Okay, so it's not really muscle size. It's more uh, definition. Yeah, let's not have two hench. That's fine. Okay. Oh, almost forgot the boobs. Let's let, let's let's gra grab those out again. There we go. You're welcome, love. I've just made you very much more attractive to the opposite sex. Right. Let's look at outfits. See what we've got. So we have outfit presets. Oh, okay. This is. Okay. There we go. Yeah, there it's it's basically just briefs and sports bras, which you know I can understand from a development uh category, but I believe there is like a community, yeah, Canvas. I think that's a community thing where community creations will be uploaded so you can download from there. And as I said, mods are accepted, so yeah, we'll get we'll get a few more interesting uh under -roos, I believe. In that. Yeah, it's just as I say, it's sports Brian Brew, so it's not particularly uh enticing, shall we say? Uh shoes. Let's have a look at shoes. So we got Standard one. Anything a bit uh, taller and you know, high heels terms? Or are they going to be relatively flat? Yeah, they look. They, they kind of. There we go. They kind of look right. Yeah, they're they're pretty low. So no no massive stilettos, unfortunately, from the look of it. Uh, we do have a. F we have six options. Uh, no, yeah, that to do. Uh, tops, shirts, sweatshirt, tank tops, vest, t-shirts, blah blah blah. Okay. So for something a little bit strappy and revealing, even though it's going to reveal a fucking sports bra underneath. Although, is it? I think it may have disappeared. Well, I'm sure if I took the dress off, it it would be back, but. I think maybe it's kind of like removing it to fit the look of the outfit, so that's cool. I'm okay with that. Of course, I'll mod it to get rid of it properly, but uh, whatever. The game's not even released yet. I'm already thinking about modding the damn thing. <laughs> oh, I know. I'm, I'm such a parvo. Yeah, nothing too exciting there. It's just general shirts and stuff. Bit of a crop top, eh, it's a bit ugly. What do I know? I'm not a fashion guru. I don't like it though. <laughs> What's this? Uh, that just screams, yes, I'm a professional. Not really. Uh, um, no. <laughs> 
So it's the outerwear. Coats and shit. Cool. Leather jacket. Yes. There's a leather jacket. Leather-ish jacket, I'd say. Probably a faux leather one. I've got one of those. I'm not cool enough to wear actual leather. Pants, shorts, mini skirts. Now we're cooking with gas. Yeah, they're not terribly, terribly mini, but they'll do. They'll do for the moment, I guess. Oh, it's a leather one. We'll have that. Accessories. Yeah. Now we're speaking my language. Oh, there's socks. Poodoo. Uh, they're all socks. I am surprised by that. You'd think... Oh, God, I hate that. That That's horrible. Asymmetrical boots. Ugh. Yuck. Okay. So, right, that's... Well, well uh, I guess nothing. So that, just, that takes it off. Okay. No shoes anywhere. So, we've kind of gone through all that. Uh, it does say customize outfit, so let's see what we can do. What is this? Where is this to? There's buttons. Oh, wait, it does that. Oh, I can customize the length of it. Doesn't go as short as I thought it would, looking at that preview picture. <laughs> okay. Let's we customize our oh, sleeves. Okay. Kind of digging that. So just the length. Yeah, we'll keep the sleeves off. Collar? Yep. Okay, I prefer that. <laughs> We're gradually, gradually taking it down. <laughs> so is, is that the only thing I can customize, though? Or is it the... Okay, so I, it, it's like a generic sort of skirt. It's like skirt, you just get to do length. I don't know if there's material or whatever. No, yeah, that's good to me. I'm easily pleased. What is this, underwear? No, that's just pants if I want pants. I'm sure I'm just breezing over most of this. There is a studio thing here. What is that? Special poses, backgrounds. Oh, I have a house. Why not? Uh, uh, lighting, backlight, so this is just the, uh, yeah. Let's see that expression. Um, oh, there we go. See what this looks like, we'll go through them. Yeah, that, that's pretty much the look I get off of like most my the women I know, and uh, yeah, that includes my wife. Yeah, that that's it. That's perfect. Um, like that expression and that pose, I, I've recreated my wife basically. <laughs> I hope she doesn't listen to this. I'd be in trouble. All right, accessories. I quite like a woman in glasses. I don't know if it's just me. Is that just me? Am I a weird guy for, for that? Uh, needs a bit more frame. A bit, no, uh, a bit too much frame. Yeah, a bit Harry Potter. Uh, no, a bit Dumbledore. <laughs> it's a bit phone nerd, you know. There we go. Uh, so we got a color with ah here we go ah so main color subcut your my texture so there we go we just make it black I guess Is that? yeah oh I can change the gloss the positioning the pattern scale cool so there's quite a lot you can do in terms of customization. watching on tele. Oh, it's on. Oh, you've got better stuff than I do, the bitch. Oh well. Okay. 
What else have we got? Necklaces. Tell me there's a pearl one. Come on. I'll do it for the laughs. It's not coming up. I'm wondering if... Because she's wearing stuff with collars. Maybe that's why. Uh, give some pearl earrings there. <laughs> it's not quite the same as a pearl necklace, I know. But, ah. Uh. Oh, that's a point. We haven't checked out the hair options. We must do that. Okay, I guess that'd be on face. Face presets. Nice hair. Here we go. Yeah, no word from you, brother. To quote Hulkster. <laughs> yeah. All right, now we're talking. Get behind that. Oh, 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 I see there's highlights and stuff. Uh, change all hair to match. Will that just... Yeah, that will. Okay. Right, let's take it down a bit. Slightly. But... So, what a... Oh, shit. It's this. That's why. Uh, okay. It's kind of a pinky red, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know about that. It can look good for a dark kind of deal. Mm, it's still a bit pinky. What if I change this? I guess not. Whatevs. Oh, you can change... Oh, that's cool. I like that. You can just change the length of the cut that you're looking at. Not a fan of that. <laughs> Let's get it long again. Edge softness. Okay, that seems to have done very little. I'm sure it's doing something incredibly important and I'm just too dense to see it, but there you go. Uh, so, custom. Okay, then. <laughs> so, uh, eyes. You gotta have, if you're having red hair, you got to have some green eyes. It's the law. I'm sorry. Right, makeup. Right, time to make her look like a slag. Lipstick. <laughs> of course, red. Oh, no. There we go. Kind of matches the hair. Eyeliner. Oh, yes. Lots of that. Yeah, oh, yep. Uh, uh, yep. Uh, uh. A bit darker on the eye shadow, maybe. I can actually see what's going on. Oh, the intensity. There we go. Oh, okay. Holy crap. Look at all those points you can move on her face. You could really drill in at this, man. I mean, I'm just doing a quick little have a look video. But damn. There's a lot going on. Let's, let's get rid of this studio tab. There we go. Okay, reason you're happy with that. Uh, eyeshadow, right. Yeah, 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 uh, yeah, intensity. There we go. Lovely. Oh, I didn't do the gloss on the lipstick, did I? Let's have a look at that. Is it this one? Oh, here. Oh, there's no gloss. Oh. oh, I see. Here we go. Wow, it actually sections the gloss part out. That's pretty cool. See, I do have her pearl necklace on. I swear. <laughs> okay, so let, let's click this. Because this is like the download. Of, I think this is like the... Okay, I'm, I'm no, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Attachment, AR company, introduction AR. AR company where life story you will oversee the realm of in Zoe. You talk to the Zoe's and carry out numerous life tasks. Our mission creating the life you've dreamed of and experiencing the life given to you. Use our simple customization tools to build the life you want, experiencing unforeseen events allows you to craft your own unique narratives. Cover life streaming through diverse experiences. Okay, we'll just pretend it didn't use that word, that's fine. Your mentor will now 
Psyker is my mentor, apparently. Did you understand? Anything? Let me explain what exactly your work will entail. Okay, so this is kind of like a primer. Uh, everything, controlling the city, finding jobs, buying furniture, today's task, choosing traits. Okay, there's a lot. I don't have time to go through all this right now, so. Right, I'm happy enough with that. So, would you like to save the current Zoe to presets and finish the process? The save Zoe can then be used in the official version. You can check the save Zoe in the Zoe preset tab. Complete. So, there we go. And I can add family and stuff. That's cool. So that was a quick little look at the character creation for Inzoe, or Inzui, or however you pronounce it, Inzoi? Maybe it's Zoiks! Hi hi! Pretty much what I was expecting. Looks like there's going to be a lot of customization options available to it, uh, just inside the game itself. Which kind of makes up for it, because uh, th there's not a huge amount of stuff in there, to be fair. Particularly when it comes to Under Rouge, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm just saying. But as I say, mods are confirmed. So that's cool. And I will be very much looking forward to the release date of this, where I can, uh, well, pervert it massively, to be frank with you. <laughs> but I've, I'm, I'm like that guy who loves The Sims. Less so nowadays. I mean, I don't really care that they're pushing like pronouns and shit into it. Uh, it's not, it's something that I'm a fan of, but you know, someone's out there that plays The Sims that could be, so whatever. I don't really care. I don't have to use it, so I'm fine. Uh, but uh, they certainly have, it's been, I think it peaked it's, it's like Sims 3, I would say. Because in that, you actually had like the open neighborhood and they sort of pulled it back to rabbit holes. And it's just, nah. It's not as good. You can have cars. You can't have a car anymore. It sucks. I want a car. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I got the original one back in the day and living, what was it, Living Large? Something like the expansion pack. Um, Sims 2, I uh, I got the alternative message, shall we say, at the time. And uh, because, you know, slow internet and stuff took it overnight to do whatever it was I was doing. I don't know what I was doing. Um, so it finished in the morning and I'm like, shit, I've got to go to work. So I called in sick that day and just played the, spent the day playing The Sims 2. <laughs> it's okay, I don't work there anymore, it's fine. <laughs> and I don't do things like that anymore. When, when does this release? Hopefully it's not a weekday. I don't know. <laughs> no, if it's anything like any other game, it'll release after work anyway. Normally we'll release about 6 o'clock in this country, so whatever. Yeah, but as I, said, I think three was the best. Four, you know, I still play it, but only because I've modded the fuck out of it. And yes, I don't think it, it could be sold by EA in its current modded state. Put it that way. Anyway, guys, that's in Zoe. Um, it's obviously the character creator is free on Steam right now, so if you want to check it out, you can do just that. You will have to create a craft and account to just get into the damn thing. Um, it's not too onerous, but it is a bit of a pain in the ass. If I'm honest, I didn't appreciate it because I just wanted to have a quick look and film a video. So, but, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, relatively impressed. I think there's, I think there's a lot to dig into there, and probably a lot of which I just missed and skipped over or whatever. Uh, certainly, communications and mods and stuff like that coming. I think it's going to have a lot of legs, which is nice because you know that's why The Sims is still popular. So with that, I think I'll leave it there, and we'll just uh, we'll just catch you next time, won't we? Eh, like we always do. <laughs> Take it easy, guys. Catch you next time.